one coming at you again. Something new from Midwest Industries. This is the MC TAR 21 G2, otherwise known as the Gen 2 mid length two piece free float handguard. And you heard correctly, I said two piece free float. Now, the innovative design of this handguard allows you to install a free float handguard using your existing barrel nut without taking apart your upper receiver or your barrel assembly. You merely have to take off your delta ring package and in an upcoming video I'm going to show you step by step just how to do that. But for right now let's take a closer look at this shall we? Alright, let's take a look at it. Take it out of the package here. Now you do get full instructions with it on how to install it and some technical notes. Now the handguard also comes with provided Allen wrench, extra screw, and thread locking compound if you so choose to use it. Now, as with all the Gen 2 series handguards, these are piston compatible with most of your popular piston systems such as CMMG, STAG, Smith & Wesson. For any compatibility questions as to your particular rifle, feel free to contact Midwest Industries. They'd be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. Now it does come in three colors, black, flat dark earth, and OD green. Machined from 6061 T6 aluminum, receives a mil spec anodized T3 hard coating. You have four 1913 mil spec rails, laser etched numbering in the T-slots. Now the measurements on your mil spec rails are mil spec correct as to the T-slot placement as from the last T-slot on the receiver to the fr first T-slot on the handguard. This gives you a monolithic or continuous rail configuration for mounting several different styles of optic platforms. Again, it is a free float. Has the front and rear, right and left, limited travel QD sling swivel ports, thus eliminating the need for additional hardware or adapters. And it is made 100% in the USA by hardworking American men and women just like yourself. What do you say we take a look at the inside? Okay. Now the handguard upper and lower pieces are held in place by six screws. You have four in the rear of the handguard which mounts around your barrel nut and two in the front. <clears throat> we'll separate them. Now as I did say it is piston compatible and as you can see here the upper part of the handguard has been machined out. This will accommodate your piston rod And as you can see, the sling swivel ports are machined into the handguard itself. On the lower half, you can see that this is also machined out 
to lighten the weight. The mid-length handguard weighs in at 11.3 ounces. Now as it does use your existing barrel nut, as you can see this area here, the little trough here, that is where it mounts to your barrel nut. And the teeth of the nut go right in here. Now if the question of handguard rotation is in your mind, these two little tabs right here are anti-rotational tabs on the lower half of the handguard. These will fit alongside your upper receiver once tightened down with the four screws on your barrel nut and aligned properly. Handguard rotation is virtually impossible. And it really is very easy to install. Well, there you have the MC TAR-21 G2 two-piece free float handguard. Not only is it piston compatible and comes in three colors, it comes in four sizes. Carving length, mid-length, which is the one we took a look at, 10 inch and full rifle length. I hope I piqued your interest. If you have any compatibility questions or on your particular make or model of AR, feel free to contact Midwest Industries. I'll put the link in the description below. Be sure to catch the installation video if you are interested in this. It really is quite easy to install. This is Ethron 1 for Midwest Industries. Get some! Till next time, people.